As the temperatures start to taper off, it is prime time to hop on the bike for exercise or just a little bit of fresh air. But even the best cyclists can hit a pothole and take a spill. So is it time to replace your bike helmet? 12 on your side's Marilyn Moritz has some recommendations and an important recall. In the past year, the number of people getting back on the bike is up. So are falls and injuries. So what kind of shape is your helmet in? Bike helmets are not indestructible. Consumer Reports' Kevin Loria says bike helmets most effectively protect you from head injury if it fits well and it's not damaged. If you've been in a crash, you need to replace your helmet as soon as possible. A helmet can look fine after a crash, but there could be damage. And experts say everyone should replace their helmet every five years or so because the protective foam and plastic can break down over time, especially in a hot garage. One obvious sign is if you see any cracks in the foam. A more subtle sign you may need a new helmet is if the colors have started to fade. That's a sign the helmet may have been weakened by heat or sun exposure over time and check the chin straps too to make sure that they're in good shape. Two helmets that scored well in Consumer Reports rigorous tests are the Chiro Register MIPS and the Lem Boulevard. For kids, they recommend the Bontrager Tyro and the Garneau Nino. And heads up parents, is this your child's bike helmet? It's under recall because it doesn't meet standards and may not protect a child's head in a crash. It's the Turbo Ski Toddler from Ski Outdoors of Texas. The small size is recalled. Return it for a refund or a new helmet. Marilyn Moritz, KSAT 12 News.